Welcome to the Race Factory. My name is Frode and tonight I'm going to talk to 10 times Formula 1 world champion Guido Capellini. After he stopped racing himself, he stepped into the team manager position where he has won 6 world championship titles for Team Abu Dhabi. Do you think he's going to stop there? No way. We're actually talking about Guido Capellini here. Guido Capellini released yesterday his new website. All his stories can be seen and heard and we're going to talk a lot about his websites on tonight's show. For tonight's live show we have also prepared questions from Powerboat Racing World, Chris Davis and Steve Michaels. And if you have a question please post it as a comment and I will put it up on the screen and transfer it to Capolini himself. At the Race Factory, we have talked to the likes of Sean Torrente, Marit Ströme, Timmy Siebel, Alex Carella. We have also spoken to Scott Gilman and Sami Selio and Eric Stark. It's become quite a good uh, Sunday night's live chat and it's become very popular. So I hope you will like tonight's special edition with Guido Capellini himself. But first, have a look at this one. To put on this live show, Guido, was uh, an mm. idea from me to speak to people around the world. No? And uh, it started mm. to become uh, popular. And uh, now uh, we have a lot of people following. We have people from uh, South Africa, from uh, uh, your second country, Abu Dhabi. Rashid Al Tayer, he says uh, hello. And uh, Kevin McCrory, Formula 3 driver, says hello. We have people from England. Uh, I would like to say thank you very much for all the people who are coming to the show. Uh, because, uh, Guido, yesterday you uh, released uh, your uh, new website. Tell us about uh, mm, yes. the, the, the website. Is it uh, a result of the Corona COVID-19 that you have time to, uh, to do this uh, big job? Uh, now this is improved to to this type wow. of action, no? Uh, because the people stay in home, they have more time for think uh, what is possible, uh, create uh, best solution also for the website. No? Uh -huh. But uh, I don't know how much time you not coming in DAC example. Okay. But uh, in these months is uh, is one uh, revolution. No? Yes. It's uh, coming uh, much, much better than before, because I have time for for uh, working in uh, in this situation that before not possible because no time because the race uh, for the pressure for the race for the, you have uh, another uh, focus, no? How is the focus and how is the pressure before you was uh, your own? Come, how can I say boss now you have the responsibility of the team Abu Dhabi uh, is a completely new uh, situation uh, explain us uh, the different from the pressure uh, for for this and and also the feeling it's not completely different because uh, before I is not just the driver I is the driver I is the team manager Mm -hmm. And uh, also before is the people who go to research the money, mm -hmm. research the sponsor, yes. uh, take the contact with the sponsor, and uh, it's it's difficult like now. Yes. Plus, plus drive the boat. Okay, it's <laughs> not a joke, no. Never. And uh, no, now I have the same pressure for organize the team, yeah. organize one good uh, good team, good uh, organize, good mechanics, good uh, everything good for for try to win, but not have the problem for drive. 
No. Different is selection the driver that possible win. And <laughs> in this moment, I have one uh, good selection, no? Definitely. Formula one, Formula two, yeah, Formula one, Formula two, and also endurance. In um, which which leads me directly to one question because in 2018. Uh, Abu Dhabi uh, was uh, having a super team with three pilots uh, and um, mm. you made uh, history all uh, in power boating in general you make history with one two three one two three and until the last race we don't understand who is going to be the world champion no yeah but the question yes is, I but, remember question mm -hmm. is um, uh, was your decision or was it from the from the promoter or from the club who want to go back to only two uh, two driver no first uh, is the sh decision for the promoter because uh, um, take out the possibility to uh, team not contractor mm -hmm. not in franchise to you to have uh, three driver uh, but honestly uh, honestly for me it's uh, one uh, not bad decision because uh, one year in this uh, uh, for three potential world <laughs> champion in the team it's really not easy really not easy uh, just uh, in the last race i possible have one relax mm -hmm. because uh, in the last race uh, the driver decide uh, who is the world champ, who is the driver to win, no? Yeah, cool. And uh, for me, it's not. Uh, I possible go in the beach in the last, yeah. no? Because uh, <laughs> all the work is finished, and now, now, it, now, in this in this moment, the pressure is coming down because uh, in any case, Abu Dhabi is world champion, yes. and uh, I not possible have one. Uh, uh, prefer no because for me all drivers working for Abu Dhabi and yes. for me the goal is get, get the Abu Dhabi win. But did they manage to stay friends all the way till the end? Absolutely or, yes. No fighting Absolutely. in the team. Yes. No, 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 no. Uh, just uh, some occasion, but not for not in front of me, driver with driver, but not too much. Not too much. It's not uh, not like Ferrari last year, no. I you remember from yes. uh, <laughs> from Leclerc. And... Yes. No, no, no. Non, uh, I have one create one very good uh, atmosphere, yeah. and uh, and the driver working in the good way. Cannot be easy because they they are so competitive. I mean, you understand better than anybody uh, how much you want to win. And uh, Thani, Eric, and uh, and Sean were all very very competitive and doing the best uh, race of their life uh, in the same season. No, no, it's uh, clear. It is not easy, but depend of the direction. No, mm -hmm. uh, so you be strong and uh, have the rules. For all and uh, all respect the rules. Uh, it's uh, easy, not easy, but oh. is much better than uh, than uh, not have rules. I understand. I have some good news for you, Alistair uh, in Abu Dhabi Club. He said uh, to let everybody know, Abu Dhabi Sport Council have today allowed the Marine Academy to reopen uh, with procedures. Very good. So they are back. Uh, so this means that slowly, slowly the club is uh, is coming back to uh, to performance. Very good because I want uh, the new talent, no? Yes. I want the new driver. Yes. And uh, Alistair in this moment working uh, in very good uh, direction. Yes. And uh, have all my support and uh, also my team in case because. Uh, the future is the younger, no? Of course. For the young, for the young driver, yeah. and uh, and uh, spend the energy for uh, and research for this is uh, very important for uh, for every result in the future. Question, difficult one. Hmm. Do you think you s retired from racing? Now we talk about the age, no? You think you retired from the racing too early 
because uh, you go out uh, after the gold of the 10 world championship but do you think that you still could uh, continue to race well not because the i close my uh, my page for uh, for racing yeah. and uh, honestly is not the one my priority no okay no? Uh, special because now we have one family yeah. different than before cannot have child and uh, no mm -hmm. I like my life now and the um, race is um, a different stress and different priority uh -huh. maybe now I is difficult for me have in this moment before yes because I decide uh, my friends remember that in the my race career I speak more than one time okay, I never want one child in case I racing yeah, yeah and I respect my decision because immediately after uh, finish to race I have tried to have one child Nasser is uh, online with us uh, our good friend from the club Hi, Nasser. Nasser is here he's so, saying um, also there is a big news coming okay that's interesting Feel ah. free, Nasser, to, to post it in the comment and I will read it for Guido, no problem at all. And I will keep the secret, if it's secret, you know. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm waiting. Of course, the, the situation changes, Guido, when you have kids and Marco is coming into your life. Uh, but um, when I now go through your website, there is, it's not possible mm. to talk about uh, Guido Capellini, his racing career without talking also about uh, Crashelini, okay? Because uh, he was very famous uh, around the world because uh, he had uh, a very spectacular racing style. Um, tell us one accident which I see in your site today is uh, the Bristol one, okay? You are going... Yes. Uh, I don't... I focus so much on your boat that I don't see which uh, boat was next to you. Do you remember? Um, honestly, I remember... I never remember. No. I just look the video and uh, and remember the accident uh, one lap before. Yeah, okay. Uh, not one lap before because this is the start. Yeah. In the start. But... Mm. Uh, I prefer also not remember, no, because in case you have uh, focus, this image is better uh, not uh, good for your Korea, no, and uh, especially because after this bad, very bad, because you consider that I is, is just one driver is survive to the world to the the Bristol, yeah. it's me, mm -hmm. it's uh, it's not a joke, no, because mm -hmm. uh, also. Also in this uh, in this accident, all the people is happy because uh, understand that maybe the cockpit working good and it's possible also race again in Bristol. Yeah. But unfortunately, then after one year in the same place, uh, Salabert is died, mm. no, mm -hmm. and have the cockpit. Yeah. For this reason, uh, the cockpit was to survive but not uh, is 100% uh, uh, safe for the in case uh, you have one accident in in the wool in this uh, speed you know because it's absolutely not good I go now on your website which is due to technology behind us okay uh, mm, and okay. I push uh, the button which says uh, the innovator and okay. uh, DAC Racing has uh, helped us. And you know, Guido, I owe you my life because uh, your safe cockpit saved my life in Tunsberg. A race that uh, actually Nasser is putting a comment here that he missed. And I can tell you that the race in Tunsberg will happen 7 to 9 of August. And I hope that everybody can travel and come. It will not be World Championship, but it will be a Scandinavian uh, round uh, and we will uh, make a race. So I hope that uh, everybody can uh, can join us. But going back to the uh, to the innovator. OK, I'd like to ask you. Yeah. What is the 
because you make many safety improvements and you study this for your whole racing life and and you was a test pilot in your own boat so you risk your life yeah. to uh, to improve the the safety if you should pick one one uh, thing you produce uh, which uh, makes you more proud what is the what is the number one for the safety which you create uh but maybe the the picker force mm -hmm. this is the number one big innovator in the in the catamaran no yes after because they also i are back but i back is not uh, the people who have uh, invent the air bag but uh -huh. my company is first is uh, have um, create and sell mm -hmm. the the airbag. Yes. After also the crash box. You yeah. remember crash box? I also, remember. Many people, many people is and not it's not my idea. It's the UN mm -hmm. create uh, the rules for the crash box, no? And uh, ninety five percent then driver not want. Exactly. Hundred percent the boat builder not want mm -hmm. no sorry 99 per 99. percent because i prepare one boat mm -hmm. and start because because in case i not prepare one boat maybe not uh, the power will not have the the crash box yeah. no yeah. you remember yeah yeah after this uh it's one incredible improve for the safety okay yeah and uh, maybe i not uh, very happy for uh, the another boat, not boat builder, but people can sell the uh, crash box not real mm. and pit. You remember, no? I remember. I not, uh, <laughs> I not mentioned the name. I not mentioned the name. But for me, the life is more important mm. than have uh, 20 kilo less uh, than uh, than uh, and maybe go half second faster. No. Do you think this you, is the? Do you think your boat yes. lose any championship title because people was actually cheating on the crash box? No, 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 no. Because in any case, I working uh, in in the rules. Yeah. I working uh, in the, in the smart system. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, another try to win in the shitty, but not a win in any case. Okay, no. Mm -hmm. and, just just it's uh, happy it's not um, the people who have created this not have one bad uh, uh, results than have people who has died uh, for this because yeah. you imagine inside to you mm -hmm. so you have one accident mm -hmm. okay, is your responsible no mm -hmm. fortunately it's not uh, arrived this uh, event no no thanks god and uh, I am sure yeah. if I don't race your boat in Tönsberg when I had the accident mm. uh, with your driver, uh, yes. I am not sure that we have this interview today because uh, the accident yeah. was uh, incredible hard. So uh, You imagine in case your uh, crash boat is not a uh, real crash boat or, or no, not you is not in this position now. No, no, no. no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let me I is very happy. I very happy for this. No? Also, because, me with uh, also. I working good. Yeah, definitely. Um, Alistair is saying that the crane on the drop front was a great help and has been used on many occasions. Also, uh, I get the feeling that mm. you have some uh, something to do also with this one. Uh, sorry, not understand the question. Good. Ali Alistair, uh, he's saying that yes. The, the, the grua, yeah. no, the crane for the for the drop box. The crane, yes, yes, is also yes. a fantastic uh, innovation to to save the the driver life. No, yes, uh, also this is one fantastic innovation, uh -huh. but not uh, start now. No. It's a long time. Mm. It's after the accident, uh, uh, and you remember Anton Van Erben, no? Yes, in, uh, he's died uh, in in Italy, in Gallipoli. Yeah. After this accident, uh, Ralph Frelling uh, and me decide to
to start to create one uh, system for not uh, have uh, problem like uh, in the Anton accident mm -hmm. and created the crane. Yeah. Uh, this in in many years uh, the crane is uh, help a lot of people, but not enough because many time many time the um, is not used in hundred uh, percent good system, no. Mm -hmm. And uh, sometimes I have uh, in fighting with the with the rescue because sometimes I see the rescue not use immediately the mm -hmm. crane, mm -hmm. but uh, go in the water for look the situation and blah blah blah. Mm -hmm. I first in the dri I the driver also you yes and in case you in the water mm -hmm. no and start to not brain and take water you prefer that the rescue come to look the situation or you take the out immediately your body Hook. in the face in your face out of the water of course, no of course. and uh, for this reason sometime i have a fighting but maybe now the situation is uh, it's clear it's coming better and uh, and uh, now the rescue use immediately the crane also for the test yeah okay the race okay the race the rescue have the the crane yeah but uh, many, many uh, time, many team working and uh, in home and uh, in case not have the safety system, is take the risk. Yes. And I want to uh, have in my boat the crane and now Abu Dhabi and Salem have uh, decided to produce the the um, boat uh, for the rescue, mm. special for the rescue with the crane, mm. and it is very good because the the test now is a safety like uh, race. A normal race, and this is 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 very important. Another one uh, argument for the safety is uh, I not uh, understand why Formula Three, no Formula Three, sorry, Formula Two and Formula One have airbag and for the child child or the small category like formula 4 is not mandatory but not because i sell the airbag this is not my my goal is not sell more airbag the my goal is uh, have uh, maximum uh, safety for the Everybody, of course, special for the young people cannot have experience. No, of course, y you you ask uh, to hundred people, hundred people maybe explain that the number one uh, safety equipment is not for the is better to have not the professional people, but for the people cannot have experience because of mm -hmm. more more. Uh, possibility to have one accident because not have experience. Exactly. And what is the difference for one child or one inexperienced and one uh, famous driver? For mm. me, nothing. nothing. For me, it's not non-exist no. different. No, I uh, agree with you. We have a lot of friends uh, on the show tonight, uh, Guido, and uh, one name which I want to put up on the screen is uh, Steve Curtin. You remember him? Hi, Steve. <laughs> Ciao. Steve is following us uh, every Sunday, and um, uh, he have to have one of the more famous uh, flips uh, in the world when he <laughs> crash uh, his Mitsubishi boat. Anyway, uh, yeah. I have a question for you. Um, we have yes. some uh, some uh, friends who always follow the show, and uh, Sven Krekels from uh, from Germany. He have the same question to everybody. Okay. And mm -hmm. it's about pizza. Okay, you're Italian. Ah. And he asked, uh, ananas on the pizza? Yes or no? Absolutely no. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely no. <laughs> <laughs> ananas and pizza is not pizza. It's not pizza. It's another name. It's, not, it's another name, but not pizza. <laughs> I can imagine. I can imagine. Yeah. Um, I'm uh, putting up a little picture of the of the boat with the crane in the back, so people who not understand uh, can uh, can see. Um, mm. Anyway, Guido, um, 
now um, you released uh, the website and um, a lot of people have uh, of course uh, seen it this uh, this uh, last few days you publish it in your facebook uh, so i see mm -hmm. many was uh, happy for this um if you should i i wait i waiting to present my website in your uh, near to your uh, interview no thank you very much thank you very much and the website is very beautiful the website is thank very you. beautiful I uh, want you. everybody to go and uh, visit uh, guidocapellini.com. Uh, the site is uh, is up. It's a uh, very modern site. It uh, mm -hmm. has uh, a lot about the driver, the innovator, the team manager. You can find uh, everything uh, everything there. I spent quite a few hours looking at uh, at your uh, your website. Everything from uh, from the uh, record boat, which is still in uh, in Monaco and uh, so on one of the question which is prepared from uh, from uh, steve michaels is that um, let me see here um, no this one was from uh, chris davis uh, in your formula one career you had several mm -hmm. good uh, teammates uh, sugihara rogero comparato uh, which other formula one driver that you raced against uh, did you wish you could have as a teammate? Did you ever have uh, a driver you wanted inside your team? Uh, uh, difficult question, no? Yes. Maybe it's better not have one strong driver, no? Because maybe it's possible to have uh, uh, 100%, not... Uh, your, not uh, Jonathan Jones. Okay. Because he's too strong. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Maybe another. It's uh, another. is possible. Is one good fighting. Yeah. But uh, for me, Jonathan is one 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 step up than another. No. Okay. And um, I have a little scare to to Jonathan. So I <laughs> prefer not to have Jonathan. Does this mean that uh, the driver you respect the most and uh, and uh, think uh, best of is Jonathan Jones from your time as a Formula One pilot? Was was this man the hardest competitor you have? Maybe maybe yes because uh, because fortunately Jonathan is a very very good driver. Uh -huh. uh, Fortunately for me, it's not very good uh, selection for the board because never have used one duck. Okay. No? And this and this for me is one of the reasons because Jonathan <laughs> not have win more than me. <laughs> but uh, but in any case, is uh, is one of the very strong uh, driver in the water. Fantastic. And what about my friend Michael, or you, our friend Michael Werner? Uh, Michael, you, Michael, you raced against uh, him many I times. Not because, no, Michael is my. I remember me. In the, he's very young, and I, you know, I have worked in Molinari factory, no? Yes. And I remember very good uh, Michael, but especially the wife of Mark Michael, <laughs> because I remember his incredible, beautiful, beautiful uh, wife. Yes, yes. But apart of wife, Michael is very, very strong driver also. Yeah. And uh, in one part of my career, I have uh, fighting. I have a lot of fighting, but never have one problem in the water with Michael. Okay. I don't remember one problem. Some protest after the race. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't remember the name of the people. Uh, it's uh, friends of Michael and uh, it's like a lawyer, no? Yeah, yeah. Work hard, uh, work hard in front uh, for the solve problem with me. Yes. But me and Michael never have one problem, and also is one of the best drivers I have. Uh, I have in front of me in the water. Yeah, ah. very good. Talking about uh, lawyer and talking about uh, fighting outside the water. Okay. Okay. Um, 
this question is from uh, Steve Michaels, uh, the, who mm. followed you for 35 years. Uh, yes. he, he says, um, explain to us what happened in Grand Prix of Bulgaria in 2000 when you were uh, suspended for the rest of the season and Scott Gilman, he won uh, his second world championship. He puts in the knife, eh? <laughs> Uh, apparently, it's one crazy decision. Maybe it's crazy decision. Take one hand and go to break everything in the in you, the you took a place hammer. with the yeah 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 yeah. <laughs> but what did you break? I not uh, but no everything everything <laughs> computer <laughs> from the timing. <laughs> but yes, but why why? The, the people not understand that it's one uh, mission yes. for change in better, <laughs> no? Because uh, before the, I don't know the equipment or the people. Many times, <laughs> many times in this, in this, especially in this year, have a big mistake, yes. and every time, every time the mistake in the opposite of my position, no? Yeah, it's yeah. not. Uh, after one time, two times, three times, sorry, but I broke my ball yes. and go to take them and go to break. After this, after this, okay, I pay for my crazy oh, okay. action, no? Yes, yes, yes. But a lot of drivers come with me and explain thank you, yes. thank you, because yeah. also for this action, mm -hmm. the promoter have improved the system to take the time mm -hmm. and uh, the level of this is grain up okay okay i pay because uh, i lose one world champion yeah. okay but for the for the formula one it's one uh, step more high yeah so also this was uh, Clear, innovation attention Yes, no. Uh, I prefer not have one one example for the young <laughs> driver. No, not take Emmer and go to break everything in case the, your time is not very good. <laughs> no way, no way. It's not. Uh, it's not this the system. No. But uh, long time ago, yeah, yeah. the technology is improving, coming better, and this is the one of the solution for. Uh, for everyone, good Ali before changing better. Exactly. Honestly, Guido, I think I am smiling because we talk about this episode before. And okay, everybody has uh, heard this story, but I'm also smiling because it showed the, the character. You know, you wanted so much to win and you wanted so much to change that, okay, we are human. You know, it's, uh, it's an action which makes for me an interesting character. Uh, it's, uh, mm. it's, uh, I think on the power boat today, um, we speak with Sean Torrente. I speak to the other driver. The image outside is that everybody is friends, everybody happy, everybody quiet, everything is, uh, blah, blah, blah. I like more action. You know, I like to, to have, uh, an, uh, race hero who is a bit crazy. Uh, so for me, it's uh, okay. It's not a good example for the, for the young driver, but it also show the, uh, the passion and the ambition for, uh, for the driver. So for me, you are, uh, you have, uh, for sure, uh, no, no problem. You make too many good for, <laughs> no, I also is one argument to remember. No, of course, of course. it's difficult. Maybe people not, uh, Maybe, yes, I remember a lot of race I win and blah, 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 but also I have uh, another argument to speak uh, exactly. for my career. No? Exactly. Talking about win, uh, we know that you have 10 time um, world champion for your name. We know also that you have uh, six world championship title for your team Abu Dhabi. Uh, and... Um, one of the questions coming from uh, Chris Davis is if you could choose a race venue where you win a race and they will name a street after you, 
which venue would that be? What is the favorite memory? Sorry, Sorry I want the square. You want the square? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> street, is, street is not enough. <laughs> no, not enough. <laughs> square is okay. Square, square is, is okay. okay. Yeah. Capellini Square. Yeah. And where should the square be? Oh, okay. Maybe uh, in Abu Dhabi. Uh, in Abu Dhabi? It's like, uh, yes, yes. So with all the Abu Dhabi friends uh, following us uh, tonight in the yes, show, it's a message. It's a message. It's a message. No? It's a message. <laughs> yes. uh, maybe after, maybe after four world champion Formula One. No, maybe this is the goal. This is the goal. Let oh. me see. We have a lot of uh, of uh, questions here. Ken McCrory was uh, racing uh, also, and uh, he is asking who is the main designer of the DAC boat. Uh, as you know, uh, hang on a second. Who is the main designer of DAC boat? As you now, uh, no, since you are not racing, are you still the designer? Are you still the constructor, or is it Atilio, or who is uh, uh, who is the designer behind the the boat? Is it the team complete? No, the designer is me. Okay, I decide the line, and I have one staff. Uh, uh, for uh, uh, fix my idea in the in the no in the um, not in the paper because now not use the paper no. for no. one project no no and uh, after my idea start to uh, look uh, in the winter 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 gallery room. yeah mm -hmm. yes and. Uh, and check the efficient for the aerodynamic, for the hydrodynamic, for the also look good or not uh, yeah, yeah. is important for one boat. Of course. And uh, this is the uh, this is the system. Before help a lot also the my uh, experience mm -hmm. in the water. Mm -hmm. But fortunately now I have a lot of information to arrive to the telemetry mm -hmm. and uh, oh, in case one driver, the normal driver or the super driver drive on board, yeah. I have one feedback mm -hmm. and the video explain me what is the feedback mm -hmm. and uh, what is the problem or the positive uh, um, solution with the new solution or mm -hmm. in case the modify is not good. Fortunately, now exists this uh, system because in case not, it's a problem. All your life you had especially two guys together with you. Uh, tell us about uh, the uh, relationship with... No, uh, three guys. Three guys, sorry. Three guys. There is Atilio and Giacomo. Yeah. Tell, tell us a little bit about uh, uh, how you started and, and how you work with the team. Because uh, your team is, uh, is a lifetime story and they are still, uh, you are all still together. But it's, so you look, uh, I have post one pictures uh, one month ago. Yes. With, uh, with me and my team in go-kart. Yes. No? In the 84. Uh -huh. No, 82-84. It's uh, the team can win the Italian champion in go-kart. Uh -huh. okay? uh -huh. You look, that this team is the same team now in Abu Dhabi team. Exactly. No? And uh, two of these guys start the school with me. Okay. Giacomo and Attilio uh -huh. start to the school, five years old. Okay. And continue in, in my life. Uh -huh till now uh -huh. and Dennis is my cousin yes. and uh, also stay with me for life no? uh -huh. Uh -huh. but this is the potential is one of my best help mm -hmm. because many, many times I not uh, I not use uh, to speech no it's enough one look mm -hmm. and the mm -hmm. people understand mm -hmm. what is the situation no of course uh, working one direction another direction it's uh it's a spend life with me you imagine no and, uh, also take these results it's uh, one 
uh, result for all the team after is coming another people not because I have another people who stay with me for a long time but these three people stay with me for life who has more world championship titles you or Atilio or uh, Giacomo I know they have uh, as a mechanic a lot of world titles no they they win more world titles than you or uh, how is the calculation uh I not understand exactly the uh, the, the, question. I, the question. Atilio and Giacomo, they work and Dennis, they work also on ah, Team ah. Qatar and they work on different uh, different team. Ah, do they have more World Championship uh, title win than you? I don't know. It's better uh, take the calculator and check, <laughs> no? Because uh, honestly, this is the not uh, not prepared this way <laughs> no but i know in any case is the in any case is one uh, also in qatar is mm. one uh, team uh, uh, results exactly. no? because the qatar use bo- use the duck yeah and uh, who produce the duck uh-huh. and uh, this is the this is the uh, situation qatar have one uh, help to me because i approval mm. with the people mm. uh, work uh, in every in every moment uh, all together yeah uh, there is a lot of interest on the new mercury uh, engine and um, one of the questions here is People are very interested in the new uh, Mercury uh, V8 uh, four-stroke engine. Have DAC Racing designed a new boat for uh, this project, or will they design a new boat? But now I start to use uh, two of this engine in my uh, support unit okay. in Lake of Como. Yes. No? <laughs> And start to understand uh, what is the potential of this engine. Okay, it's uh, really, really incredible. Uh-huh. The 450 is one of the best engines okay, I have tried. Uh-huh. Um, uh, the problem for me is not uh, is not simple, no, because uh, in Formula One secret of the Formula One mm-hmm. and the success of the Formula One is is not uh, too much uh, expensive to transport this type of boat because the boat stay in the container, have one uh, uh, good uh, dimension yes. and power for, for stay in the container. Clear, you fix the one engine that okay, have uh, 15 kilo more than now. Yeah. Normally, the boat, the dimension of the boat change. How much and now the different? Conte- hey, how much uh, is different? To is difficult to explain, and especially maybe I not want to explain to you no. because all people look at that. <laughs> but uh, I, I have one idea, but it's difficult to after to resolve the problem for the transport. Yes, in case not, uh, in case not have this problem mm-hmm. maybe it's very easy to to change the to change the the engine no mm-hmm. because uh, like you remember in formula 2 yeah no optimax mm-hmm. all uh, not want because in one year all have optimax and change all have changed the the, the engine yeah but optimax compared to the another uh, engine is uh, not too much different no okay. little heavy but little heavy okay and in any case the boat is changed completely but in any case the boat stay in the container okay. now uh, it's important to understand what is the best uh, um, compromise uh-huh. for uh, for transport and and performance yes this is the this is the main point when do you think it will be uh, possible to start to test this new uh, Formula One concept? Will we speak about 2021, 2022? When is the when can the fans see the new concept? For me, this year already. 
Mm. Wow. This year is possible start to look. Hmm. End of this year, maybe it's possible start. Va bene. But start to test is uh, is not. Uh, uh, I repeat, is is not easy. Have the compromise for uh, for uh, have the boat can stay in the container and have this type of engine. Okay, it's an incredible engine, eh? Because yeah. for power, for uh, for uh, the engineering in the US have uh, working very good. I look the project is unbelievable. It's yeah. one of the best projects I see in the, my life. But uh, now it's uh, the engineering for the boat. It uh, is not easy to, to have a good solution for to solve this problem, the problem for the transport. I understand. Back to your racing career, uh, Guido. Uh, we know the Ten uh, Mondiale. We know how big of an mm. achievement this was for you. But if you should pick one moment in your racing career, who was the number one, um, what what moment was this which race what was the if you should try to to imagine one moment in your racing career as a driver uh, which moment will this be uh, positive or negative positive we only speak positive <laughs> ah, the the most uh, incredible moment is the, my first win uh, in Como, yeah. in Como I had race, all the race apart one. Okay. And uh, but the first, the first one is uh, incredible because in the last lap I broken my fuel pump. Okay. And the engine is switch off. Yeah. And do you imagine I is in the second position, no? Yeah. And for me, it's enough arrive in the second position yeah, yeah. Uh, in Como in front of my <laughs> sure. public, no? Yeah. And for, in the first position is Jonathan Joss. Ah. No? Jonathan Joss, you remember Jonathan Joss? I Jones, hear no? about him. <laughs> uh, uh. But in the last lap, Jonathan, in the same moment I broke the my fuel pump, uh -huh. after 300 meters, Jonathan flipped. Have one accident. Okay. And, but I never understand. The rescue take my boat and go to the pontoon, and I look the people incredible happy come to me to. I not understand why because uh, I broken the 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 fuel pump is not alive. Yeah. But in the same moment, understand that I win the race. <laughs> I win the, my first race because they go because, one lap back. Yes, because Jonathan. It's a uh, lead, but broken, broken, at the accident. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I is broken the engine, but take the classific one day, one lap before. before yes. One lap before is I in the second position. Yeah. But Jonathan is disqualified and win the race. <laughs> you imagine? Yeah, 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 yeah. In Como. Yeah. No. This is one incredible story, no? But exactly. I have also another lot of, uh, I remember a lot of win, example in Portugal. After uh, one race, me and Scott, uh, uh, Scott is in front of me for all the race, okay? Yeah. And in the last corner, <laughs> last corner, I pass Scott, I win. Yeah, cool. ah, also, this is not, uh, it's difficult to not remember, no? No, no, no. Because no. imagine, it's one of the best system for win uh, <coughs> like in the like in the motorbike. No? Yeah, 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 yeah. Only one left that counts, the last one. So uh, yeah, the yeah. last one corner. Eh? Exactly, Not the last one left. <laughs> exactly the last corner. Um, you know a guy called uh, Alessandro Cremona. You know this guy. Mm. He said, you? "Yes." Have you had any regrets in your career? That you thinking today, you say would change everything change. Have um, let me. Was that? Have you had any? Okay. Have you had any regrets in your career? Um, anything you? Was that regret? Regret is. Um, ah, we have the translator helping us. No, just for understand. Um, 
The Italian boys are, are putting up a lot of questions here. Uh, another guy is uh, mm. is putting up Leo. Ah. You understand? Ah, yes, yes. One is uh, is uh, in in 2008. I lose the world champion in Abu Dhabi in uh, Sharjah. Uh -huh. uh, I lead in the in the classific, and for me, it's important just arrive in the seventh position. Uh -huh. And uh, I prepare the boat in maniacal uh, system for not have any problem Echo. for win my 10 title. Yeah. Okay. And in the middle of the race, my position is seven for not take any risk more than yeah. stress my engine. And I broke one piece, maybe the cost is 20 euro. Yeah. Uh -huh. Change it knew before the race one electrical piece yeah and i lose the world champion for this this is one of the my best bad decision moment, okay no? one of the my bad Nic moments. nicola yeah. giorgi he is uh, sending in comments and Hi, saying uh, hello and uh, he is actually translating he says regrets is uh, rimpianti okay yes now we learn something new uh, another guy, uh, Leo Bonelli, he is asking for a friend. Okay, he said, Ciao, Leo. "Do you prefer Nutella or uh, other?" <laughs> I think they're joking. <laughs> allora, before, before is one big, big match. Ecco, very big match. <laughs> now, now, tell me. It's, uh, Change, uh, I change my um, idea okay. with Nutella, not for another. Okay. Okay. For Nutella, yes, yeah. because I never eat Nutella now. Okay. Uh, you look my yeah, yeah. style. Yeah. Now. It's <laughs> a long time. Why. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, but it's... not change an idea to another. Okay. No, no, no. Um, it's uh, good. We have a lot of friends and uh, Guido. I know you are a record man, and I can tell you that we already have the record with the more uh, public looking the the show tonight. So, uh, ah, okay. I I like this is important. This yeah, is because... important always. <laughs> I like to go yeah. on to the next uh, uh, tema I like to speak to you about. Uh, we have already okay. passed uh, 55 minutes, but I would like to speak to you about uh, the role and Team Abu Dhabi. But before we do this, okay. I like to play one video. I have a surprise for you because uh, you have a lot of good friends. Okay. We are proud to have Guido Cabellini, 10 time World Championship to win uh, Abu Dhabi team, so with him we get more than uh, six world championship, so he transfer his knowledge. Good morning, my name is Paleh Mansouri, driver of team Abu Dhabi. Guido Cabellini is one of the best coach in the world. Guido Cabellini, you are the best Rashid Altai from team Abu Dhabi. Good afternoon from Florida, Sean Torrente, Formula One back-to-back -back and current world champion. And on tonight, I'm so excited as Guido Capellini because this man helped me accomplish my dream because of how great he is, not only as a manager, but as a driver and, and how well he knows the sport. So I can't wait to watch him talk. I miss all my guys. We haven't seen each other for six months face to face because of the pandemic, but hopefully soon. That was all your drivers, Guido, or some of them. It was uh, Faled, it was uh, Sean Torrente, it was uh, Salem who sent a uh, message because when they hear that you was coming to uh, to talk with me live and present your website, uh -huh. uh, I challenged them. I said, uh, please send me a video and uh, I know you guys have... Uh, you have seen them in Abu Dhabi because you were there, but uh, the team has not been collected uh, and joined together since December. Um, tell, uh, tell us a little bit about your uh, life in Abu Dhabi. You are now the team manager and uh, we know that you already won six world championships. Um, tell us about your work uh, with, the, with the club and uh, the future plan. But apart from 10 world champions, six in Formula 1, but 10 to endurance and Formula 2, and uh, ah. but it's 10 world champions in Abu Dhabi. 10-10? Ten, ten. Uh, uh, yes. No, it's 11, but one is not full me, okay. full mile, okay? Uh, but 10, yes, because uh, it's uh, in Formula 1, 
Endurance, Formula 2, and uh, uh, what is the question? My life in Abu Dhabi? Yes, yes. Tell us about uh, your life in Abu Dhabi as the team manager and how you train the boys there and uh, so on. Uh, I I'm very happy to to move my residence in, in Abu Dhabi because I have one uh, very positive ambient, mm -hmm. very positive. Uh, in the club, it's changed a lot, special, uh, special for the new activity like Academy, mm -hmm. uh, the rescue and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Also, the I have uh, created one uh, Formula Two team, uh, incredible strong. Mm -hmm. oh, I know. <laughs> uh, in uh, also in endurance. Yeah. And uh, it's very good because uh, all the people it enthusiastic to, to work, uh, especially also because they arrive the result, no. Yes, and uh, you know, for me, it's very important not just the result but also the image. Mm. And uh, Abu Dhabi has changed a lot because yes. now it's uh, number one in the world for the image. Mm. Mm. And uh, this is very important because uh, for the for the club, for the Abu Dhabi, for Sports Council, it's very important that Abu Dhabi is one uh, of the best, and it's better to eat the best, not just for the result but for the image. The people. Look, uh, the team in the in the race understand that the 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 professional and everything is compared to the to the UAE national. No, mm -hmm. it's very it's one honor for me to represent one country like this. It's uh, it's very happy also because repeat uh, it's arrive uh, a part of the. Part of the work is arrive results. But how is it to manage to have your whole team coming to Abu Dhabi? Because uh, you are not young anymore. You are uh, with a family and uh, you have a son. And also you bring your your uh, friends from uh, and and teammates, Atilio, Giacomo and Dennis. Uh, how do they like to to move to uh, to Abu Dhabi and work? Is it hard for? Uh, for having them to to uh, to move also, or do they stay at home no, and, and come and go? No, normally, 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 just me. I move stable uh, my my family in Abu Dhabi. Okay. But um, another team stay in uh, in Europe. Yeah. And uh, sometimes is in Abu Dhabi. Maybe one month in Abu Dhabi, two months in Europe, uh, and coming back. And uh, I have this. Uh, Combination, it's winner combination because uh, eighty percent of the race, Formula Two, Formula One, uh, and endurance is in Europe, yeah. and I have one very good base in Europe for uh, for prepare the season and uh, for prepare also the the boat because the technology it, it's uh, is very important. Use the technology in in Italy. Okay. Also, some uh, some um, company mm -hmm. work not just for me, but for Audi, for Ferrari, for uh, and they take a lot of uh, experience to another ambience. No, mm -hmm. uh, also Ducati. I, I have. Uh, I like also to go to see the. Um, the another friends in MotoGP or in yeah, Formula yeah. One mm. for take some uh, idea, no idea, yeah. and uh, and use for my ambience. Exactly. I have spent my life in uh, in uh, Monte Carlo for uh, the, and improve a lot image and uh, and uh, the technology because I look uh, another ambience. Exactly. And not stay close in mind, no? No, no, no. Antonio Josef, he is one of your guys in Abu Dhabi. He says, uh, all the success come from hard work. And Guido is the backbone of Team Abu Dhabi. That's another compliment from your team members, uh, Guido. Thank you. They Thank are happy you. To uh, sometimes it's not easy. 
Sometimes it's not easy to to wake up uh, five o'clock in the morning for stay in the six o'clock in the in the water. No, you I remember see. in Abu Dhabi, see the I team. See. Uh, I see. Every, every, morning, not, every morning I was yeah. out. You had the boat in the water before seven o'clock uh, and, yes. and testing. Yeah, and sometimes six o'clock. No, but it's not easy. But. Uh, it's one of the the people working uh, and is happy yeah. to working in this yeah. direction. Special, yeah. special in case arrive result because you have worked not for nothing, no. Of course. And uh, it's clear. Apparently, for the people, is easy. Abu Dhabi win every time, no, or win many times. Yeah, yeah. But it's not easy. It's not easy. It's a fruit of a lot of work and. Uh, and the people who work for me understand this is one of the uh, is no compromise. No, no, no. Working hard, no. Working hard, work in the in the good direction, and after result arrive. I have to say, uh, for me, I would think that you was more relaxed. But when I uh, was in Abu Dhabi in December month. Uh, you was the first guy in the pits in the morning and you were many times the last guy in the pit at night. How do you motivate yourself uh, still uh, to, to do this? Because one thing is to win as a driver, another thing is to win as a team manager. Where do you find the, the energy? Uh, what, is the, what is the secret uh, Guido Capellini uh, mix here? How? But I think maybe the passion is the the passion is the number one. Yes. Uh, because it's not uh, for money. It's not for. Uh, it's for passion. Yes. So you not have uh, this is difficult to. It's difficult work in this direction, no? Exactly. Because repeat, it's uh, uh, and, and also mentality. Yeah, yeah. Because you not have the mentality for this, also mm -hmm. for the image, no? Yeah, yeah. You, I many times I look in the paddock, stay and look everything, yeah, no? Yeah. Paper in the yeah, rubbish yeah. or uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I sorry I broke the ball to all, but uh, <laughs> but not for nothing, no? Because uh, after after the results uh, you look and uh, the people is happy because. Uh, Staying uh, number one is not is not bad. Eh? It's, it's always uh, beautiful. I have a question yeah. from uh, Stephen Hammond from France. He asking, do you think Formula One track need to be more technical, like for example uh, Augusta Grand Prix uh, in the endurance? You know, more technical uh, uh, circuits. Uh, yes or no? Absolutely yes. Absolutely yes. One of the my best, uh, one of the best uh, race track, it's in Como. Yeah. And Renato Molinari have designed this uh, this circuit. Go inside in the arbor, go outside. Exactly. And in, also for the show, also for the public, is incredible. Honestly, like the two, to four pink cores, like. Uh, the race for the uh, hydroplan, no? Yeah. Hydroplan like is not catamaran, no, no absolutely no. not. Also because it's dangerous, because catamaran is a, is one uh, board for turn, yeah, yeah. for turn, not for flying. The, no. And this is the, but not because I have advantage in one or another, no. because in any case Abu Dhabi have winning all mm. type of race track, mm. but. For the public and for the safety, it's much better and technical yeah. because the speed is too much down. Yeah. And for the in case you have a, one accident, the is is low danger for the driver, no? Yeah. Because uh, you have one accident, 220, 230 km per hour is uh, different than 200. Mm -hmm. But the show, in case you have more turn, is much better. And also, you have more possibility to to move the classific. No, you're talking a lot about uh, the young driver, the academy in Abu Dhabi, and so on. Will we see a uh, DAC Formula Four boat in the future? You have idea to, uh, to uh, for this? Unfortunately, not have uh, enough time. 
No. For this, no, because uh, I like uh, normally I um, I use my energy for uh, for have uh, results in the top class, mm -hmm. and uh, in, I not have a lot of people can work in in DAC. No. And uh, and uh, these people is enough for Formula Two and for Formula One. Yeah. And uh, not have time for uh, build also Formula Four. Mm. This is the reason because I not produce this type of boat. You raced many times in England, and uh, Jason Mantrip he asked uh, which UK race course did you enjoy the most as a driver, and what is the reason for this choice? Which race course in England was the best? And, and why? Uh, England, it's one uh, place, it's historical place for power, but no. Uh -huh. uh, I remember I have race in London, I have race in Cardiff, I have race in Bristol. Yes. And uh, the atmosphere, it's uh, similar to race in Italy, because, yeah. uh, because the public is uh, enthusiastic. Mm -hmm. And uh, unfortunately now not a race again mm -hmm. in uh, in England because maybe uh, uh, maybe in Formula One the one of the problem is the cost because the Formula One have one uh, uh, big uh, big uh, infrastructure now for move uh, one organized like Formula One is no joke because they have a lot of cost yeah. sometimes. It's difficult for one country, but I don't understand why not racing Formula Two. Uh -huh. okay, it's mm -hmm. a different cost, and why not uh, why not uh, possible organize one race in uh, in Formula Two? Okay, it's yeah. uh, maybe in, not maybe not in Bristol because in any case it's very dangerous. Apart, okay, I one of the my. Uh, not like uh, situation is not win one time in Bristol. Ah, no, never. Yeah, no. Unfortunately, no. This is one. <laughs> it's not don't like this. No. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but part of this, part of this, it's uh, England have a lot of place for for have, uh, the race. Yes. And uh, why why the people not uh, try? To organize well maybe it's, a, before, it's uh, a challenge for them to uh, to come up with uh, a formula 2 race it's an uh, yes. it's a wish from guido capellini to, that we should go back to race in england uh, yes that's uh, that's true let me have a look at the comments guido because we have so many friends from around the world we have uh, a question here if you remember um, a guy in South Africa, Mr. Lindenberg. Of course, you remember. Oh, uh, I, I I remember very good. <laughs> I, uh, sometimes he's friends, sometimes he's not friends, but in any case, he's friends. Uh, end of the story, is friends. Yes, yes, yes. Who was the most competitive driver in in Formula One in South Africa? Was this Lindenberg or? Ah, be, Peter. Yes, Peter Lindenberg is the king of South Africa, no? Because uh, organized race, uh, it's a driver racing Formula One. Yes. Have a lot of uh, no. It's a, it's a work hard for the power boat in uh, in South Africa, and uh, I race also in South Africa many times mm. and like it much because the the people is uh, enthusiastic. I have a sponsor yeah. also in South Africa. It's, I have a very good memory in Durban. Yes, or Johannesburg. Yeah, yes, I remember. I remember the race. Aziz Rahman, he is asking uh, if you think there will be any UAM races uh, this year. Um, and uh, when do you think we can start racing? Uh, this is not uh, a difficult question because now the situation uh, is coming better. Yeah. Coming better. But maybe the people won't look. Uh, Formula One or MotoGP, after start the engine in uh, Formula One, yeah. MotoGP, NASCAR, after maybe the people start to understand that it's better 
move the ass and start also empower but no uh, 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 because this is the but before now in this moment uh, many people scare no yeah but immediately after start Formula one and moto gp and nascar uh, for me it's also the organized start to want again race of course and ken mccrory has another question about your formula one team he asking do you have team order like in formula one car do you have a number one driver and a f number two driver, or can Sean and Thani uh, race on the same uh, condition? Or Ma, uh, normally no, because uh, the proof is that I have three drivers in uh, two years ago yeah. in the in the World Champion and ride three driver end of the season in the last race mm -hmm. and all three drivers not have any any order, uh, order. and uh, the three driver possible use all the our uh, capacity for win exactly. not uh, have any influence to the to the team it's clear okay, in case one uh, i don't know in one uh, season one of the driver is in front of another in another one and another no possible win it's clear can another work for the yeah. first mm -hmm. this is normal yeah but not in case uh, both have the possibility to win the world champion i understand i understand well guido we had uh, a very nice uh, time here this uh, sunday i'm very happy that we can uh, talk about power boating even we c if we cannot race at uh, the moment do you think there is a chance that uh, you can bring uh, your formula 2 team to uh, to norway in august if the if the borders are open uh, or are team abu dhabi only going for world championship events uh, i have one contract for the world champion mm -hmm. and uh, but i have a good friend in norway yes one is in front of me <laughs> and uh, i I try my best for come. Do you have boats in Europe? Because in any case, I have boats in Europe. Uh, in the period is August, no? Seven to nine no. of August, yes. Uh, uh, I have the boat in Europe, but um, it's not my decision. No, I possible push, but it's not my decision. I have to call my friend uh, Salem. Feeling, also? feeling, feeling. Yes, feeling is is uh, try to come yes. because. Uh, Maybe I convinced to the organize the world champion, no? <laughs> to in the yes. last minute, in, in the, the last minute, change the idea and uh, okay, then, world then champion and uh, first first race in the world champion. No? I have to then say, then you have to ask my wife because uh, she's uh, the finance minister. <laughs> no, maybe, maybe, maybe possible uh, ask to Thomas and uh, and uh, maybe try to have one. Uh, degrees for the p for, for i don't know because the this this year is different than all the another years no and maybe it's possible have one chance for start also in different format no yeah mm. why not why not i have a new format which i like to try i want to have half an hour free practice half an hour time trial sprint one sprint two the start for sprint two will be top six change so that if you win the sprint one you start in sixth position in the sprint two the point from sprint one and sprint two is the start order for the grand prix at night i want to make a format so i can run uh, training qualifying sprint one sprint two and a grand prix in one day no, I is very happy because produce more boat for arriving the final. Exactly. <laughs> Maybe not enough one spare, but now two spare. Now because with the... Maybe this is the thing. Maybe this is the. How yeah. how many boat is uh, DAC factory producing per year? This was one of the question. From uh, uh, Matt. In the in the good uh, in the good moment, uh, arrived to fifteen boat. Fifteen boat. But uh, yeah, but before then the cockpit. Uh, uh, with uh, crash box, uh, with uh, mm -hmm. long long time ago, fifteen time ago. Now, now it's uh, maximum five, six maximum. 
Widow, you announced Morning. your uh, website uh, here uh, yesterday. I would like to uh, show the people uh, that the website is live behind us. There are a lot of good stories and uh, as a powerboat racing fan, I can assure you that uh, uh, all the information is there from the day you started racing, even go-kart, to the record boat at the M Monaco Museum. You have also a lot of good comments from friends around the world who has been driving uh, against you. The promoter, Nicola Di San Germano, has uh, come with a beautiful uh, compliment on this site. And also MotoGP drivers and, and sponsors. Uh, when you see all this comment, yes. do you sometimes uh, say, uh, bravo Guido, do you, can, you, no. can you enjoy it? You, you consider that I pay a lot all these <laughs> people for speak very good no and uh, this is the problem because my pocket is uh, it's very light now no? but no it's a part of joke no it's uh, like this uh, this uh, part of the website because uh, sometimes uh, it's difficult to to realize what you create, no? And maybe sometimes I look this and I is happy because I am working good in uh, in yeah, Lotto. Yeah. In all all this my career. Yeah. I want to say thank you very much. Uh, we could uh, stay here and talk for hours, but uh, as uh, a very effective man like you are, uh, we have already broken the record. You have beaten Sean Torrente and Marit Ströme and all the guys in uh, in the numbers of views and comments and uh, so on. So uh, I think we will uh, call it a night, uh, Guido. Say hello to Marco for me and your wife. Okay. And, uh, I hope to see you very soon in a race. And uh, until then, Best uh, and stay safe. Thank you. Thank you all. Ciao tutti. Bye. Welcome to the Race Factory.